What's going on everybody? Welcome back. Today we're going to be checking out Elementor, which is one of the most popular website building plugins for WordPress. I'm going to talk about the good, the bad, the pros and cons and everything in between, including what the free and paid versions have to offer. So hopefully by the end of this video, you'll be able to make more of an informed decision as to whether or not Elementor is actually a good choice for you and your situation. Now, if at any point in this video, you'd like to check out Elementor for yourself, you'll find all the useful links, including a discount to help you save a little bit more money in the description down below. All right, so when it comes to website builders, a lot of people are actually deterred from using any just because of the complex aspects of backend development. But that's not the case with Elementor because from the moment you install the plugin, you'll get one of the best onboarding experiences, teaching you how to basically use everything Elementor has to offer, from adding sections to inserting widgets. In fact, you might not even need a tutorial anyway, just because of how sleek and intuitive the interface is. It offers a real-time front-end editing experience, unlike other website builders that have you go back and forth between building and previewing. You can just use the drag and drop functionality to insert anything you want onto your website, and what you see is basically what you get. And this is great, especially for businesses and freelancers who don't have the resources to hire a web designer or don't want to waste time learning all that stuff anyways. Now, as far as the features, you'll see that both the free and pro versions have plenty to offer, starting with a free version. And just because it's free doesn't mean it has nothing to offer. The free version is actually stacked with the essential features that you'll need to create a great website. For example, using widgets like text, images, videos, buttons, and so on. You can create sections, columns, and various types of content on your website. Not only that, but you also get basic design features like spacing, borders, backgrounds, and topography. Also, Elementor has a lot of advanced features that go beyond just the basics. An example of such features would be the ability to add motion effects like vertical and horizontal scrolling and advanced widgets like carousels and testimonials. Plus, the design capabilities go beyond basics. You can even edit the CSS directly if you're so inclined. Now, in general, you'll be just fine with the free version of Elementor if you just want to design some basic landing pages or add some style to your blog posts. However, if you want to use Elementor to design your entire website, you'll probably want the powerful new features design options and all the templates that are available in Elementor Pro. Those features can transform your website design from an already great one to an outstanding and eye-catching one. For example, one standout feature I would say is the theme builder, which allows you to easily create custom headers, footers, and block page layouts. This means you can change almost any part of your WordPress's themes design, giving you full control over how your site looks. Also, Elementor Pro includes the pop-up builder, allowing you to design attention-grabbing pop-ups that drive results. Whether you want to collect emails, promote a sale, or just share some important announcements, you can do it pretty effectively. And on top of that, Elementor Pro provides advanced targeting and triggering options, ensuring that you can display the right message to the right audience and at the perfect moment. Now, I wanted to talk about the templates separately, as this was honestly the most impressive thing about Elementor. No matter what kind of website you're creating, whether it's for a blog, an online store, a law firm, or anything else, you'll find templates that perfectly match your vision. These templates look great, the design looks very professional, and it gives off the impression that they were tailored just for you by a professional agency. If you checked out the templates from the other website builders, you'll appreciate how significant this is, as some of these templates can look quite dated, like they're straight out of the early 2000s or something. In contrast, Elementor's templates are modern, stylish, and completely adaptable to any screen size, from smartphones to desktop. Now, you might be wondering, how does Elementor fare against the other website builders like Beaver Builder, WP Bakery, or Divi? Well, in terms of ease of use and features, I would say Elementor truly shines here. While some other builders might have a couple of standout features, Elementor seems like more of an all-encompassing solution, being specifically designed for WordPress. Because of that, it effortlessly integrates with the platform and many other plugins. Now, from my experience, Elementor works great no matter what you're trying to do. Let's say you're doing personal blogs, it actually makes it very effortless to incorporate dynamic content and create visually appealing layouts. Now, when it comes to e-commerce, the WooCommerce Builder integration allows you to tailor your product pages with stunning results. However, where Elementor truly shines, in my opinion, is in crafting persuasive landing pages. As I mentioned earlier, it offers built-in marketing widgets like countdown timers and testimonial carousels that simplify the process. Now, what truly sets Elementor apart, and this is something I really want to talk about, is the strong community and support system. Whenever you face a problem or want to explore something new, chances are someone else already has that figured out. 
Now, the Elementor Facebook community is very alive, and all of them, from my experience, were super friendly and knowledgeable. Everybody there is just willing to help as much as they can. So whether you're just starting out with simple questions or you're a seasoned user looking for some valuable advice, this community's got your back, and they're super friendly. I love it. Also, Elementor's official support is equally impressive. The team offers assistance around the clock to pro users and maintains a comprehensive knowledge base accessible to all. Whether you're dealing with the basics like installation and problem solving or delving into more advanced customization techniques, you'll find detailed guides and video tutorials to help you overcome any challenges you may face. Now, as far as pricing, it's made to accommodate various needs and budgets, a thoughtful approach in my opinion. Even the free version of Elementor is a powerful tool that can handle many website design tasks effectively. However, upgrade to the pro version adds extra features that truly justify the investment. The essential plan, priced at just $59 per year for one site, includes all the pro features along with a year of updates and support. For freelance designers or agencies, the expert plan at $199 a year for 25 sites or the agency plan at $399 a year for 1,000 sites may be more suitable. It's worth noting that all the plans do come with a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you can try them out without any financial risk. And of course, don't forget to check out the link in the description for a special discount if you end up getting Elementor Pro. Now, to wrap things up, Elementor does have a few cons, but they aren't exactly deal breakers. I'd just say that these are just some nitpicks that I found and maybe you could take them into consideration if you'd like. For example, if you're trying to contact customer service during peak hours, you're more likely to experience some delay. Uh, now, if you're new to WordPress and website builders in general, the experience might be a little overwhelming at first, but that's exactly why they have an onboarding process to teach you everything you need to know about the service. Okay, now that I've covered everything Elementor has to offer, would I actually recommend it? Absolutely. Sure, it has a few hiccups here and there, but it's generally one of the best, if not the best, website builders I've ever tested. It's very intuitive, incredibly easy to use, and you have a spectrum of themes, widgets, and templates that are all thoroughly designed to fit modern times. And if you want to take your website or websites rather to the next level, you can definitely do that by switching to Elementor Pro. And that'll be it for today's video. Again, if you're interested in Elementor, you'll find all the useful links, including a special discount in the description down below. And feel free to comment below if you have any questions as I love getting to interact with you guys. And like this video if you found it helpful or would like to stay up to date with future videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.